Hello and welcome to this video on demand and supply analysis, with a focus on consumer demand and a real-life example. In this video, we will delve into the various factors that impact the demand for goods and services, and how changes in these factors can lead to changes in the market. We will use a real-life example to illustrate these concepts, so get ready to apply your economic knowledge in a practical context. Let's get started. First, let's define what we mean by demand. Demand refers to the amount of a particular good or service that consumers are willing and able to purchase at a given price. This willingness and ability are influenced by various factors such as the price of the good or service, the consumer's income, the price of related goods, and their tastes and preferences. One of the key concepts in demand analysis is the concept of demand elasticity. Demand elasticity measures the responsiveness of the quantity demanded to changes in price, income, or the price of related goods. A good is considered to have elastic demand if a small change in price leads to a large change in the quantity demanded, while it is considered to have inelastic demand if a change in price has little effect on the quantity demanded. Let's consider a real-life example to help illustrate these concepts. Suppose we are analyzing the demand for coffee. We know that the price of coffee has increased, and we want to understand how this change in price will impact the demand for coffee. We can conclude that coffee has a relatively elastic demand, meaning that a small change in price will lead to a significant change in the quantity demanded. As the price of coffee increases, we would expect to see a decrease in the quantity of coffee demanded by consumers. This is because consumers may opt for alternative drinks that are cheaper, such as tea or soda. So stay tuned and join us as we use a real-life example to explore the fascinating world of consumer demand and demand and supply analysis. Thank you for joining us for this video on demand and supply analysis, with a focus on consumer demand and a real-life example. We hope that this video was informative and helpful in understanding the various factors that determine the demand for goods and services, and how changes in these factors can impact the market. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to like and subscribe for more content like this. Until next time, goodbye.